Hi everyone, Connor here from Team Block Demon, and today I'm here to show you how to get started staking your Polkadot tokens all through Ledger Live. So without further ado, let's dive in. You first need a Ledger hardware wallet and Ledger Live downloaded on your desktop or laptop. Today, I'm using a Ledger Nano S. However, you can follow along with another Ledger device, such as the Ledger Nano X as well, if you wish. You can see that I'm using a blank ledger with no apps currently installed, but because we're interested in staking Polkadot, we first need to generate our Polkadot account. To do this, I've navigated to the manager section in the left sidebar of the Ledger Live app and then searched for Polkadot. I'll click on the install button and Polkadot will be added to my ledger. Once installed, click on the add account button that now appears. Make sure to open the Polkadot app that has now been installed on your physical ledger device and you'll see that it begins to sync. Here you can add a new account so go ahead and click the add account button to proceed. You'll see that our account has been added successfully so simply click done. Now that we've added our Polkadot account to the Polkadot app we'll need to add funds to start staking. To do this, click on the accounts button in the left sidebar and you'll see that our dot balance is currently zero. When I click on our account, you'll see that we have the option to top up by either buying DOT or receiving it from another source. In order to stake on Ledger Live, I need a minimum of 10 DOT at the time of making this video. So I'll click on receive and then follow the steps on screen to get my Polkadot receiving address. After I've sent over a minimum of 10 DOT to my Polkadot address, I'll click on my Polkadot account in the, in the accounts tab once again. Because I have almost 12 DOT, you'll see that we have an option to earn rewards. Click on the Earn Rewards button, which will pop up an Earn Rewards screen. Now, press Continue. Here, select how much DOT you'd like to bond. In my case, I'd like to bond all of my DOT, so I'll click on the Max button. Next, click Continue and then confirm the operation on your Ledger device. You can now see that our DOT assets have been successfully bonded and an option now appears to nominate. So click nominate and you'll see a list of validators currently live on the Polkadot network. Type Blockdaemon into the search bar to search for Blockdaemon's validator. Here we click on the checkbox for all elected Blockdaemon validators on the network. This is to guarantee uh, and ensure maximum potential for rewards by nominating as many as possible. Note that you can nominate up to 16. Following this, confirm that you're happy to choose and nominate Block Demon on Ledger to finalize the operation. Once you've confirmed on your physical Ledger device, you'll see that we have successfully nominated Block Demon's validator. You can choose to view details if you like, which will take you to Polkadot's subscan site. So there you have it. That is how you get started staking your Polkadot tokens all through your Ledger Live. I hope this video is helpful. And if you have any questions about staking the Block Demon or the staking process on Polkadot, please do not hesitate to reach out to us. But until next time, I hope you have a great day and take care.